Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Maida and you're watching Maida Pores. Thank you so much for joining me today. If it's your first time here, you are very welcome. And if you're a returning viewer, well, thank you so much for coming back, friend. It's so good to see you again. So for today's pour, I am continuing on with Dutch pours. I do have a smaller canvas here. I believe this is an 11 by 14 inch canvas. And I'm going to be doing a um, a uh, split base. I'm going to be doing the bottom part in this dioxazine purple that I have mixed up here. Um, I have this mixed pretty thin. It leaves a slight kind of trace along the top. Not really a mound though. And same with the gold. Now, these are both just Liquitex Dioxazine Purple and Liquitex Gold. Um, I'm running low on white, and so I'm just like getting creative with what I have in my stash as far as what I'm mixing up bases of. So, with that being said, I'm gonna get this canvas covered here. Okay, so I've got this flooded with the gold and the dioxazine purple, and that's my base. And now I'm gonna come in with my other colors here. I'm gonna start off with a layer of pearl fine. This is kind of because it'll blend with anything, so I want there to be like a nice kind of pretty blend of whatever is going to be hitting on this first base here. Um, then I'm going to come in with some Prussian blue. And a little pearl green. Even though I love that color, I'm going to go light. Well, let's just go just a little bit right there. <laughs> and then I'm going to go in with my pink. Shake that one up. Opening it would be a good idea. Okay. <laughs> a little pink. A little orange. A little bit of fire opal. Some gold. Now this is Iridescent Gold Bright by Golden, not the same shade as the base. And last but not least, I'm gonna squirt a little bit of black through it as well. And I'm gonna torch any bubbles out of here. And I am gonna flood it with purple just a wee bit just a wee bit. So I'm going to just do a thin layer of purple underneath here. Not to drip. And I'm going to use my new blow dryer for the first time. I have seen a lot of YouTubers use this one. Um, and I just, I had to try it, I had to get it. And the Walmart by my house actually had it in stock, so. I was able to pick one up and I was pretty excited about it. Anyway, it's The Flower by Drew Barrymore and they do sell it at Walmart. But I guess on Amazon, it, the prices are a little bit higher, but you can find it on there or a lot of it higher. I don't know. If you have it in stock in your local Walmart, it's less than $30. So that was pretty cool. All right, and I'm gonna keep it on low and I'm gonna flood it over the purple. And I can already see some cells popping up in there. I'm gonna torch. And that's cool, that's pretty. But I am gonna blow this out. But I'm not gonna blow any of the gold into the purple. I'm just gonna push this purple up into the gold. Look at this cool stuff that's happening though. And 
that is really, really pretty. Also, I'm gonna come in with my world's miniature blower. That is gorgeous, look at that. Hold on, I'm gonna torch. Oh, I absolutely love what is happening down in here. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna try to fluff up the fluff. I'm gonna fluff up the, I'm gonna wisp out the edges a bit at the top here. Okay, ooh, it's pretty. Look at that. I'm gonna just torch it one more time. I'm gonna come in with a popsicle stick. I'm gonna scrape my edges along the bottom to try to make sure it doesn't drip too much down the side. It is important to scrape your edges. I don't always show it on camera, but I do always do it. Look at this beautiful, beautiful piece. I am so, so happy with it. As always, I would love to hear what you think about this in the comments. Of course, I'm gonna be bringing you in. I can't tell if it's doing justice on camera or not. I am of course gonna bring you in for a close-up so I can show you all this gorgeous beauty that's going on down in here. That's seriously just like, wow, it's so pretty. Okay. <laughs> um, please do let me know what you think in the comments. Hit that thumbs up button if you like the video because it helps with the algorithm. Um, if you enjoy watching acrylic paint pouring, well, um, you know, please do hit that subscribe button. Acrylic pouring is what I do here. I highly, highly recommend this little blow dryer. This is my first time using it and I am like so thrilled. I also highly recommend this little guy, this like miniature, this is the world's tiniest leaf blower. I love this little guy too. Um, I am gonna bring you in for a close up now, but thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Okay, so here we go. Let me bring you in here. Look at this. I love this purple. This is one of my favorite shades of purple, but look at these gorgeous cells in here. So pretty. Absolutely love, 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 love. So pretty. And it kind of just wisps out into the gold. Oh, love it. I'd love to hear what you think in the comments. As always, please do hit that like button. I think I already said all that though. So anyway, hope you guys are having a great day and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.